Welcome back, guys, to another episode of. If you can find a way to clear it out, it could be a useful location for the resistance operating in the zone. What in the world is going on? Anyway, yeah, welcome back to another episode of Homefront. We were just seeing and talking about explosive gas and all kinds of stuff. But anyway, today we are on our way to our next main objective. The last episode, which was like a week ago. I'm sorry about the wait. Had a lot of stuff going That's on, lots of games coming out. E3's been be crazy. To take you up. But anyway, in the last episode, we went around and we kind of like defused three of those security areas for the trams. And now it's time for us to get going. What? what are we supposed to do here? It got stuck? How do you want me to get up there? We got these guys coming. Oh, God. Oh, man. We got firecrackers. Got some explosives, but I'm not. Oh, man. I thought they were going to stop right there. The elevator's out of action. Try and find another way up. There has to be a way. Oh, don't worry, I'm just shitting myself in the process. Alright, I think I see another way up. Nice. Just doing a little free running is all. Okay, Brady. I boarded a train returning empty from the shipyard. I'll be with you soon. Power on the system so the train will stop. Here it is. I think it's working. The train's slowing down. Solid. Let's go, boys. Good stuff. All right. Brady, get on. Yes, sir. Travel to Ashgate. Quickly, before they notice something's wrong. These trains are pretty intense. Oh, they're... This There's soldiers down there looking for if us. You're detected. We're both dead. This better be worth it. I'm pretty sure they're fighting underneath us right now with other uh, other of our allies. All right, good stuff, boys. So now we are traveling to Ashgate. It's kind of like a new territory, uncharted territory, and uh, we're gonna see we're gonna see what we can do. I'm excited. Your sabotage on the scanners was effective. We're out of the red zone. This is Ashgate Yellow Zone. Collaborator district to you. This is gonna be a little different to what you're accustomed to. Even the lowest rank liaison officer gets a much better standard of living. Since they're so despised by the general populace, the authorities know they have to offer sufficient perks to make the job enticing. This is the vision the KPA sold us when they arrived. Cooperation to rebuild America and repay the debts. Here, people still believe it, or at least everyone says they do. Oh wow! So this isn't quite the apocalyptic world that we've been here, just relishing finally having a little power. Part of you see it in their eyes, revenge for all the shit they ate before the KPA arrived. Anyway, practicalities. I doubt my colleagues will recognize your face, but the soldiers will be as vigilant as ever. I don't think I have an easy life here. I take risks every day that could see me tortured and killed, but not all wars can be won with guns alone. You think I'd get more recognition? Getting you through shouldn't be a problem. Just let me do the talking. All right, do it to it. Crawford. And who's this? I'm not allowed to say. He has information regarding the terrorists. Is that right? Well, uh... He's not on my list. Of course he's not, but these things can't be planned for. But his information is urgent, so let us through. Come here. Come on. I've heard things about you, Crawford. You're always pulling stuff like this. Disrespecting protocol. I'll have to report it. Well, maybe I'll make my own report. Because I've heard things too, Harris. Like when the authorities came to take your daughter to the camps. <laughs> you said she'd been killed during the troubles. 
But I wonder what a search of your apartment would turn up, huh? Blackmail, baby! We're with the right guy. Sorry to have troubled you. No trouble at all. None of us want that, do we? Come on, you must make your report. Good stuff. Holy cow, dude. Another enemy made. It's only a matter of time before this all catches up with me. I need to go and fetch Parrish whilst Harris is still on duty. You should deliver your package. Just don't stay on the streets too long. You'll attract attention. All right, here we go. Got 2,500 bucks, I'll take it. Hey, Brady, you in? I was a little worried Crawford's plan wouldn't work. He's a touchy son of a bitch, but he's useful. Now, the person I want you to take the brain to is Heather. She's a technical genius. If anyone can figure it out, it's her. I'm uploading her safe house location to your phone now. Hopefully, I'll be there myself soon, if Crawford's luck holds out. But listen. Ashgate may be full of class, but you still have to try and get people behind our cause. Keep your eyes open for opportunities to stir things up a bit. Like this right here? Hello, hearts and minds. 2% in the Ashgate yellow zone. Good stuff. Alright, let's head to this objective. Yeah, dude, this is, uh, this is a bit different. We have red roads. It's pretty cool. What are we supposed to do with this? Blow it up? We're just supposed to blow it? Is that what, I'm, I'm assuming that's what that symbol means. So, what we're gonna do... Oh nice! We got some propellant and batteries off of it. Good stuff. Free the prisoners? What happens if we just straight up shoot this guy? Good work, Brady. This will show people that the Norks can be beaten. Alright, so that helped out hearts and minds, but it also kind of made that camera mad. It didn't like us. Beggar? Can I help out a beggar? Ten bucks, got you. Alright, up to 12%. I like it. We're creating opportunities and making differences. Hey, friend. This looks like some sort of a safe house, eh? Oh, yeah. No norks. The brains of the outfit report to Wiley in the safe house. I'm Wiley. Parrish called ahead. Said you'd be bringing us a Goliath brain? I don't know how the hell you got your hands on one of those. Heather's our resident expert on all things technical. She's on her way. Give me the brain, and I'll get it ready for her. All right. Hang here. I'll be right back. I was carrying that the entire time. Where what? What the heck? All right. Now we need to wait until Heather arrives. Look at all these American flags. I got this. Just keep watching in case we're followed. Open the gate! Oh, Shit! Joe's oh, hurt! Fuck. Spence! You're up! Uh, Come on, uh, Joe. We're almost there. Uh, Spencer! Uh, this is it. I'm gonna die. Shit, Your name's bad. not going on the roll yet, Joe. I got you this far. Spencer, he took a rifle round. Close range. I need more light. Okay, let's have a look here. How did it happen? Blind without their GPS data. I need some guards. Come on, come on. Guys, back up. Spence will fix it. Just keep the pressure there. Okay, Joe, this is ketamine. You're gonna feel a bit high. <laughs> gonna feel a bit good. Okay. I got it. Looks like you'll be okay. I knew it. He just stick through the heart to kill Joe. Oh, Heather, this guy Brady's here to see you. Parrish sent him, remember? 
Hey, you're Brady. I'm Heather. Sorry. So, Parrish sent you this Goliath frame for me to look at. Sounds interesting. Let's take a look. She reminds me of plastic from, uh, Mirror's Edge. I don't know if we've met plastic yet in the Mirror's Edge series, but if you guys are watching that too. Just kind of like a weird, quirky, smart, technical girl. This is some piece of work. I hate to admit it, but modding this will be challenging. I'm gonna need to figure this out on something less complex. You think this is the time to be tinkering with Joe lying there shot? Hey, don't you think I feel it too? Spence says he'll be okay. We have to keep going. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Brady, I'm gonna need your help. I want a seeker brain. Should be similar enough to the Goliaths in principle, and I can experiment on that before I risk the real thing. Our stores are yours. Help yourself to anything you want. Hey, come on, Heather. Let Parrish supply his own guys. Wiley, it's fine. This is important. Look, Heather, we're low as it is, and you're just giving away what little we have I left. I know, but we have to work together. Don't worry, we'll organize another raid, okay? Restock as much as we can. There's no point in having a quartermaster. He ain't got any stuff. We couldn't operate without you. Whoa! Don't worry. We'll sort it. I just got sandwiched and it pushed me up on the desk. A closer look at this brain. All right. Good stuff. Well, mission accomplished. We delivered it right where it needed to go.